Hey y'all, welcome back to the DG Outdoors. Now, today's video, we have a double feature gun review. Maybe 98's got a new gun. I've got a new gun. So we're going to go over specs of those new guns. But we're going to start out with Maymay 98's new gun. So this is a Daisy model 1999. Okay. It's like an upscale version of the Daisy Red Rider. Um, but, okay, um, it's got plastic stock, pink plastic stock. This is the girl version. They also have a boy version. The boy version is camo. Okay. But it's also got pink. It does have the classic band. It doesn't have one of the... Uh, the, oh, the rings right here on the sides. Um, but it does have fiber optic sights on the front there. It's red, so you guys can see. Fiber optic sight. It's got a bigger handle, so for easier cocking. Uh, it is a, a, like, it's got a spring in here. And how many DBs does it hold in here? Remember? 350. Well, it shoots 350 feet a second. I think it holds like 350 BBs in there. But it's pretty easy to operate. You just push right here. Push in, push up. And it opens the BB port and goes in there. So this really does... Um, pretty much... It's pretty similar to the Daisy Red Rider. But it's a little bit longer and a little bit bigger. Um, you want to show them how you aim it? got open sights there uh, is no way to put a scope on here but they do make a a um, piece that you can actually put on there like for the daisy red rider you can get a mounting set which puts a weaver rail right here and then it uh, puts a weaver rail right here so you can put a scope on there um, it does have adjustable front blade it does have an adjustable rear sight right here um, this is where you put the oil in, right here at that little dot. And I picked this up at Rule King. It does have a safety right here. They push it in on, on a safety. Pretty cool little gun for her. I have a Red Rider at my mom and dad's house. I like shooting it. It's BBs only. Okay. Um, you guys can actually pick this up. It came with shooting glasses targets and a pink tin of BB so here's what the shooting glasses look like uh, here's the pink tin of BBs it came with 750 with count BBs it did come with targets I just don't remember where I put them well this I don't think came well with it, I bought her this girls with guns girls with guns um, targets to shoot at their adhesive ones so I have a little kit. This did come with a kit of uh, targets. Like, that little baseball diamonds and something else that came with it. So, what do you think of this thing? I mean, you haven't shot it yet. We're going to shoot it tomorrow. At church. At church. Yeah. We can shoot it at our church now. So, we're going to bring... We're going to do a daisy shoot-off. I'm going to bring the Grizzly, the Winchester 1100S, and the... Um, this right here. We're going to have a daisy shoot-off for a video for you guys tomorrow. Uh, this is what she wants to show off the zinc BBs that come kind of the come with your regular zinc BBs right here, guys. 4.5 millimeter, 0.177 caliber BBs, and they're pretty cool. What else did you get with it? I bought you a really big thing of BBs, didn't I? Uh -huh. Yep. You know where they are? I got this whole set at Rule King for like forty-two dollars, but then I went and bought her these for eight bucks. This is uh, four thousand BBs. A lot of BBs and it's pretty heavy. So let's get into my gun, guys. Some of you guys know I went on Walmart.com after proposing to her. She got a ring. I got a new air gun. It may sound redneck, but that's just the way it is. I picked up the Winchester 1100S brake barrel air rifle, 0.177 caliber. This is the exact gun as the Daisy. 1100S, S stands for synthetic stock. Actually, it says 1100SS. Synthetic stock is what it says, stands for. Um, this does have a white front dot side on it. I don't know if you guys can see that very well. It is white dot right there. Um, but it lines up well with the white dots on the rear side here. This is a very heavy gun. Okay, it's 48 inches long. Okay, and but it actually 
weighs really, really well in your hand. I mean, I have no problem holding it. It's very comfortable. Um, it does have a rubberized buttstock. It is a brake barrel air rifle. It only shoots pellets. So the the Daisy 1100S model of this. Okay, again, same exact gun as the Winchester 1100S, which is what I have right here. Advertises to shoot alloy pellets at 1100 feet per second. But I'm not sure. I don't have a chronograph. But the Daisy one that was actually labeled Daisy was $63 online. I spent $49 even on Walmart.com for this. I don't know if it's because the licensing to use the Winchester name in a Daisy product just ran out. So they were selling these cheaper. I don't know if it was overstocked or what. But this is one of the heavier guns that I actually have. On the stock is some really nice checkering. Makes it really nice, easy to grip. Okay. Does say Winchester. I've always wanted a Winchester gun. Never had one. So, you know, hey. Just for nostalgia's sake of the name. Um, these are windage and elevation adjustable right here. Um, steel rifled barrel on it. And I do like it. Again, this is the Model 1100 SS by Daisy. It says it right here. Uh, the hammer. So this is your safety right here. Okay. Pull it back for fire. And pull it push it forward for safety but one thing okay this is on safety watch this i can still pull that trigger back pretty far take it off of safety it goes all the way back this is a spring springer air gun it is not a nitro piston um but i cannot wait to shoot this thing tomorrow how do you load it you break down the barrel oh. like one of those and oh, you put the pellet in yep you shot a couple of these before. They're not fun to load for me. That's because you're short. You got a little arm. I'm weak. <laughs> you're not. It take me forever. Yeah, but look at you. You got the muscles. The oh, muscles. Yeah. So yeah, guys. Um, it does have a really nice padded um, recoil pad on there. I really, really like it. Again, the weight of this gun, even though it's heavy, just distributes really, really nicely in my hand. Especially if I hold artillery hold like this. It's really really nice i think i'm gonna like it i believe this screw is made for the trigger housing right here you can put a scope on here i was looking at getting a winchester scope for this but i'm not paying 50 bucks for a scope i'll just shoot it open sights like that and guys i do have air gun pellets coming to do pellet outline reviews more of them i'll probably have like 50 of them by the time this thing's done with and I have four game winner real tree um, gun cases, soft gun cases for these guns. So when I store them, so oh yeah, the stock's kind of hollow, but I mean it. It seems like a good gun for fifty bucks. Can't really beat it. So y'all, nice. yeah, it does look nice, doesn't it? I can't wait to shoot these. Can't wait to get out to shoot the beaming. Oh, that was the reason why I need another zip-up case, so I could put that extra barrel down for the Beeman uh, Grizzly X2. Who do you think is going to win tomorrow? I don't know. I think we're going to take the, the Daisy Grizzly out, and I'm going to shoot BBs against you. So. Plus, I have these that you gave me. Yeah, but you can't shoot those out of your, your no, new gun. I don't think so. But we can go get the Crossman out of the storage yeah. unit if you Isn't want to. Isn't that one my, or is my little one? It's your other pink one. Oh. The Crossman uh, 760 Pump Master Pink. Mm. But y'all remember, like, comment, subscribe. Hope you guys like this little gun review. And, uh... Jesus loves you. Yeah, Jesus loves you. Jesus does love you. Jesus loves everyone. Okay? And we will see and you And we will see you guys one. on the next one. Thanks Bye. for watching. Bye, guys.